You may recall my reporting of a slightly spiky exchange between Terunofuji and Sumo reporters the best part of three weeks ago. We can now assume those reporters were alarmed by what they saw of his practice, and implied with their questions, based on that you're going to compete? And Teru's spiky response at the time doubtless reflected the fact that he knew he likely couldn't compete, but would simply be trying his luck. Now note the dramatic change in tone. For were this business as usual, in that condition, Teru would not have appeared in March. And post pullout in March would not be appearing in May. Yet, he's already down for the April tour, for ceremonies only, and specifically vowing to fight in May. It seems there is some new deadline now, perhaps even self imposed, that he's forcing his body to meet. And it would seem all parties agree there can be no more long term layoffs. In other injury news, Kim Bozan, as you likely saw, returned today after three days out. His fall at the hands of Tamawashi on day four aggravated his neck problem. We understand the knee issues which kept him out of multiple February events are not the main concern as of now. Fourteen months ago, when he ripped through Division 2, his master touted him as at least a future Ozeki if he could just improve on his thrusting technique. And like thousands of fans of promising fighters in generations before us, we all stood there and thought, how could he not make Ozeki? We certainly have some idea now. His stablemate Hidenomi, by the way, missed day three because of acute diarrhea. While it's an open secret that lower tier men are often served subpar food, they even have a sumo term for it, Hide insists that his subpar meal was all his own fault. The vegetables he bought for himself were slightly past their best. And his lower tier colleague Higo Hikari, who has fallen off the chart, suffered the rare ignominy of being either stretched off or wheeled away from successive bouts both his last one in November, and his comeback one this time. The newly installed ringside doctor led the injury response. Hikari was diagnosed with mild concussion this time, not as serious as last year. Tsurugisho, as you perhaps saw, went down on his troubled left knee in defeat to Hidadomi on day four. NHK pundit Mainomi opined that given his fabulous form of late, Tsurugi's confidence and adrenaline simply made him forget the injury he was carrying, and caused him to automatically rely on the knee with disastrous results. Multiple ligaments damaged there, we understand. The man himself was cursing no end. Today, we learned that second tier Shirokuma had also joined the injury list. It seems he hurt his lower back against Kagayaki on day 7. Kuma has never suffered a losing score since his May 2022 pro debut. He will need to return by at least day 13 to try and maintain that record. Takakento's reappearance is still fixed for May, no change on that situation as yet. Tochimusashi told supporters pre-meet that he would be sitting this one out. It seems he's coming back in May. His colleague Tochikamiyama also will not be seen this time. Multiple hardcore fans are claiming that he has in fact walked. We can most likely expect comment from his family once this meet is over. And also rumoured to be on his way out, along with stablemate Kurokage, is Coach Miyagino's personal assistant Hoka Hall, who certainly was not injured when I spoke with him on February 12th, about this match in January, which may now prove to be his last. We will know for sure, of course, at the end of March when his stable's fate is revealed. 
Sumo chiefs have reportedly rejected the plan to move ex Hakuho to Isegahama and all his remaining men to Oshima. Instead, it seems they are pushing for both ex master and wrestlers to move under the umbrella of Asakayama, the man who castigated ex Hakuho in a recent newspaper piece. Finally, as for Terutsuyoshi, who is also off the fight card this time, he missed his last match in January due to worsening diabetes that might have had a bearing on this time's no-show.